This is BBC Two with programmes from BBC Education. North or south, east or west, the quest to save the life of Pelama goes far. Look bravely through the dragon's eye and fly. Boris and I found another clue at Ash Rock. There. Hold it up, will you? That's supposed to help, is it? There are words missing. We must work it out like the crossword. Well, it will take years. I was pretty sure the first missing word was top, because top is the opposite of bottom. The Vita Road led us to a mountain. It's like a riddle, Boris. You've got to go to the bottom of a mountain before you can get to the top. <laughs> we were about halfway up when some rocks hit Boris on the head. rocks wasn't a rock at all. It was a Viton. We were worried about Jenny. She'd seemed cold and ill, so Gorwin called her on his video phone. She showed us something Morris had knitted for her. A new scarf. What do you think? What's she trying to tell us? Help. Charm. Charm? Charm. What's charm? Charm is the enemy of Pelamar. I have defeated him once, and now I must face him once again. Here you are. Gore decided to return to Pelamar alone. He took the two Vetons we had found with him. We had to find the last one on our own. Gorwin! Could we do it in time? Gorwin had a long, long journey ahead of him, back through the woods of Widge, as night fell. Boris had a tent in his rucksack. Yeah, we pitched it and settled down for the night. Boris, you've taken up all the room. All right. Ow! Ooh. Boris, you're lying on my back. Amanda. Hey, who's got the map? Here it is. We must work out the clue for Mash Rock. Yeah, let's have a look. Oh. I wonder how far Gorwin's got. Oh, if only he could fly over which he'd be almost home by now. Worrying about Gorwin and Charm won't help. Pelamar will fade and die unless we find the last V time. That's what I'm trying to do. I think these two bits beginning with B might be the same. <laughs> <laughs> B something E of a floor that is not there. Hmm. Sounds dangerous. Mm. It could be a warning. <laughs> You're right. Be... Careful? Careful doesn't end in E. Hmm. Be... be... Beware! Yeah! Beware, beware! Two warnings. Well, we know what the first one was, don't we? Beware of rocks that fall from the air. <laughs> <laughs> it wasn't a rock, it was a Viton. There. But what about the next bit? Beware of a floor that is not there. Then climb on something again. Climb on in. Climb on out. Down. Up. Up. It's got to be up to get to the top of the mountain. Let's look at the map. You can't. Boris is sleeping on it. I'm going to sleep too. Oh. Oh. Night. Oh. Night. Oh. <laughs> 
I'll give you road safe. <laughs> We'll never catch those widgets. They haven't done any harm. Well, you're not inside my head. Sometimes I wonder what is. What? Can we go back to sleep now? Oh. Well, I'm wide awake. I know what I'll do. I'll write some notes for Sleeping Beauty. Hey, wake me up when it's breakfast time, won't you? Yes, Amanda fixed it. Where are you? I'm at the border camp. Listen, Boris. I dare not phone Jenny. Why not? Because Chan must not know I am on my way back. He must not even guess. Oh, right. If Jenny contacts you again, let me know, won't you? Yes, yes, of course. And Boris. Yes? If I no longer have the power to defeat Chan. Of course you have. Go in. You have. Have I? Let us hope so. We are all getting weaker. Good luck. Good luck to us all, eh? Go in. We'll beat Charm, won't he? Depends how weak he is without the vehicle. He needs it as much as the rest of us. And Charm knows it. Is Charm really that terrible? Oh, yes. One flash of those awful fingers and... So how can Gawain protect himself? Won't Chan turn him into a puddle? Well, he can shield himself with his wing. But while he's doing that, he can't fight back. Gawain will have to take a chance. Ready yet? Whenever you like. It's only milk and biscuits. You. I'll find my own. Let's go with him. Otherwise, he might shrink again. Don't spill any milk on the mat. <sighs> what sort of biscuits are they? Broken biscuits. Some biscuits have words on them, and some don't. What's that bit say? Sh sh short. Yeah, well done. Here's the other bit. Sh 
short. Cake. That's clever. I don't need that bit, it's got a word on it too. Let's only eat the blank bits. We'll fit the rest together. Mm. Nut. There you are. Ginger nut. Meal. That's not a whole meal for me, is it? <laughs> Boris, we call old jokes like that chestnuts. Do you? We call them cornflakes. Look, here comes the day. Light, hold my hand. And we don't want to separate. Let's enjoy the sun. Shine. We're staying together forever and ever. Daylight, sunshine. See the sparkling water fall. Hold my hand. And we don't want to separate. Shiver in the snow storm. We're staying together forever and ever. To separate, write it in your notebook. We're staying together forever and ever. Video phone notebook. Mmm, yes. A lovely ripe wedge fruit. Just what I like for breakfast. Better than stale old biscuits. Amanda! After him, Amanda, quick! Hey, you! Oh. What do you mean that way? Come on, Rosie! <laughs> ever learn how to behave. <gasps> Ow! Give us back our map, now! No! to help us. Wonderful. No words, Boris. The uphill climb. 
will take much time. If you must be quick, find the arch of brick. Go in if you dare. Beware, beware. Beware, beware. I know that. The uphill climb will take much time if you must be quick find the arch of brick go in if you dare beware beware <laughs> Boris can you read that <laughs> the arch of brick Where's that? Don't know. Well, I suggest we start looking for it straight away. This is the last of the big Vetons. Well done. What's next, Jenny? I'm not sure. I need to check with the book. I can't understand the next bit. Really? You don't think she's not understanding on purpose? Wasting time! That wouldn't be wise, would it? I can hardly see to read anymore. I need to be by the light. Goes far. Look bravely 